The next common concern we have antenatally is maternal hypothyroidism. It's very common as common as maternal diabetes these days. So you check for the history of previous hyperthyroidism because many times Graves disease may have been treated with ablation or uh, medical treatment and the mother is now hypothyroid as a result. So you should not miss because the antibodies which are there in Graves disease continue to exist and they may cross the placenta and may cause either hyper or hypothyroidism in the baby. If there is simple hypothyroidism, you send the newborn screen and you can consider the thyroid function test if the newborn screen is abnormal or if you have concerns like prolonged jaundice when you would you do the thyroid function as well. If there is a previous history of hyperthyroidism, you do the thyroid function on day 2 to 3 and repeat according to the clinical condition. So if it is simple maternal hypothyroidism which is the commonest type, the newborn screening is adequate but if you are not able to do the newborn screen, it's better to do the thyroid function.